It is a beautiful Wednesday in Phoenix. It's about 100 degrees. I just wrapped up with 20 pools for the day. I'm headed to the gym. Gonna knock out some easy miles on the treadmill and a nice little Wednesday lift session. Can't remember all the exercises. I don't know why I can't remember the Wednesday exercises off the top of my head. I know it's lat pull downs. I know it is like the glute driver machine or glute bridges, I don't know, whatever you wanna call those. Hamstring curls, some Russian twists, bird dogs. Definitely gonna knock out some push-ups as usual. A couple other exercises that I can't recall right now, but I'll uh, give a full rundown afterwards as usual. It's been a great day so far, feeling good. I've had the usual nutrition so far. One pack of Element. Gonna drink another one here in just a minute. I had coffee to start the day with a little bit of soy milk. I've had my two bagels with, I think I had 83 grams of peanut butter today and 53 grams of just fruit spread on that. I'm on Celsius number three. Just cracked that open right now. Trying to stay caffeinated. And I guess that's it. Oh, my AG1 as well. Can't forget the AG1. Keeps my micronutrients proper so that I just have to focus on my macros. Feeling good. My knee is about the same today as it has been the last few. Really just hurts if I squat down. Otherwise, it seems to be doing pretty well. So I'm just trying to keep that from getting any worse. But training is going well. Life is going pretty well. Can't complain. And it wouldn't help if I did, right? It is officially getting hot though here in Arizona, or at least in Phoenix. This week is all, supposed to be all triple digits. Nothing crazy yet. I think the hottest it's supposed to get is 103 this week. But summer is definitely here. Makes it a little more difficult to do anything with the dogs when I get home, which is frustrating because they want to go outside, but they can only be out for a couple of minutes. And then they just, like Yogi just cries when we go back inside because he wants to do something, but there's not really anything I can do with him in the condo. I might have to try and get, I don't know, like rope I can play tug of war with or with him. Some kind of toy like that. Can't really play tug of war with a ball, although he tries. But anyways, all is groovy. I'm ready to knock out this workout go kick it at the house with my boys. Ashton's working this evening, so just be a boys night at the house. I no other plans for the day, just the usual grind. Editing video, I already prepped my meals for the rest of the week, so I should be chilling. I do think I'll have to go fill the water jug, but I'll probably just knock that out whenever we go to the park later. Might be able to try and get some studying done on my coaching program, that would be nice. Just trying to take care of business. All right. I'll see you guys at the gym. First time around was a sinner, and you let me know. Second time around was a winner, now it's raining gold. Champagne showers laced with poison, how am I the last to know? leaving the gym I'm not gonna lie I'm beat today had an awesome workout 
Just did a nice chill, four miles on the treadmill to get things started. I would have gone longer than that, but uh, Ashton was a little pressed for time today because she had to be at work. And I will say I was going to get back on the treadmill after I was done lifting, but I just didn't have the energy today. And that's okay. Some days you don't got it. I haven't taken a day off of running in a while. In fact, I can't even remember the last day I took a day off. So no biggie there. Four miles is good. My watch said to take a rest day anyways. So four miles active recovery is a good way to go. So I got that in and then we did the glute hip thrusters. We did hamstring curls. Uh, I've been doing these like hip flexor cable pulls where you lay down and hook a strap over your foot and bring your hip flexor up. Basically like a knee drive, just kind of working on getting stronger through my hip flexors because that's an area that I've had trouble with in the past. And we did Russian twists, we did bird dogs, Bulgarian split squats, and then I went and did some uh, leg extensions as well just to try and strengthen up my quads a bit. Super good workout, feeling strong. I went light on weight on a lot of the things since they were leg exercises and I'm trying to take it easy on that knee. Just trying to be smart, keep the ball rolling. Capped everything off with 21 minutes in the sauna and a cold shower. And I'm looking forward to my recovery smoothie today. And I just gotta take care of the boys, edit some video, otherwise we're chilling. I got my laundry done yesterday got my meal prepping done so I'm kind of looking forward to relaxing a little bit hopefully the dogs will let me we'll see this is my everyday non-negotiable as soon as I get home from the gym I take the boys out let them go to the bathroom, play around in the courtyard for a couple minutes, and then immediately mix myself up my recovery smoothie. I do banana, blueberries, strawberries. It's usually about 100 grams of banana, 150 grams of blueberries, 150 grams of strawberries, about 15 grams of chia seeds. Um, I do water as the liquid in it and the blueberries and strawberries are frozen. Sometimes I'll do frozen banana, but I usually try and save the frozen banana for my dessert smoothie, and I usually only freeze about two at a time, so I save the frozen ones for the evening and just use a fresh one. And then I do one scoop of creatine, which is five grams, and then usually three scoops of a superfood and berry flavored um, protein powder from Sprouts, which comes out to about 60 grams of protein. So yeah, it's a perfect little recovery shake right after the gym. Gets my protein going for the day. And then as I'm sipping that, I usually unload all of my, my lunch bag, which I just unloaded my cooler and all my dirty clothes from the gym and whatnot, just kind of ease into the afternoon and set myself up for, for success for the rest of the day. Ah, that's good. Well, would you believe it if I told you we made it to the park? It's about 6.45. We've just been chilling at the house. I worked on my video. Got everything from the first half of the day all edited up and ready to rock. So now I just gotta add whatever else I shoot from the evening into the video and it'll be ready to go. Love having time to be able to do that so I'm not scrambling to get everything done at 8.30, 9 o'clock. I've been so tired all afternoon and hungry today for some reason. I feel like anytime that I've gone through phases where I've been lifting weights a lot, I uh, end up eating a lot more food. 
which I guess I just put on some muscle mass and the couple of extra pounds make me need to take in more calories, but I've been hungry today. I had my smoothie and then I had a little bit of leftover pasta that we had in the fridge. And then I had some chips and salsa also, which I've been trying to eat cleaner than that, but it's not, not that bad or anything. It's not like I was eating candy. So all good. My body could probably use the extra calories. I weighed 164 today, which I weighed right after I drank my smoothie. So that's probably not the most accurate weight, of course, but I don't weigh first thing in the morning typically because our scale is in the bathroom in the master bedroom and everybody's usually asleep in there when I get up. So I kind of just weigh whenever I think about it in the afternoons and evenings typically. So. Who knows what I actually weigh, but it gives me at least a rough idea. We were back at the condo. That was probably the lamest park session that we've had with the dogs in a while. Yogi was just not into it tonight for some reason. He was just standing right between my legs. So we packed it up, came home. I uh, opted out of my typical rice and tofu dinner because I had that pasta and those chips and salsa and so I wasn't super hungry. So I just had some puffed rice cereal with a little bit of granola thrown in there. Typically I eat that for dessert, um, but I yeah, I've pretty pretty much hit all my macros already. So I'm still gonna have my protein smoothie here in a little bit. But I just made the uh, granola and cereal my dinner. I'm putting the uh, final touches on the video here. And I'm ready to wrap it up so I can chill. I'll see you guys tomorrow. We're gonna have a great Thursday.